Maybe the one role that I had to change the most for was probably Baywatch. That movie I adopted a really, really specific eating regimen. And for Zac Efron, that regimen took a toll on his mental health. The last thing you want is to show up after training that long and look flat. Very vain of us, but what? We're in Baywatch. Yeah. <laughs> the actor is the cover star for the Men's Health October issue. And inside the mag, he opens up about his role in the 2017 film Baywatch, where he endured intense training and his abs were on full display. I mean, now you're going to have to beat me on the big boys course, princess. <sighs> <sighs> And for Zach, he says that diet isn't something he'd want to work towards again. Quote, that Baywatch look? I don't know if that's really attainable. There's just too little water in the skin. Like, it's fake. It looks CGI'd. And that required Lasix powerful diuretics to achieve. So I don't need to do that. I much prefer to have an extra, you know, 2-3% to body fat. Everything's functional. We trained for the parts. We, for this movie in particular, we, like, we wanted to achieve a look, and that required a, a specific type of training. And that extreme regimen not only impacted him physically, but mentally as well. Zach tells the mag, I started to develop insomnia, and I fell into a pretty bad depression for a long time. Something about that experience burned me out. I had a really hard time recentering. Ultimately, they chalked it up to taking way too many diuretics for way too long, and it messed something up. That was the most extreme I had ever got. And now, Zach's in total control of his body and image. I guess the philosophy around my current diet is intermittent fasting mixed with getting enough nutrition to sort of sustain me throughout the day. I started intermittent fasting just after I stopped being vegan. I feel good when I have bananas and when I have sweet potatoes. Oh, and the Hairspray Star's ultimate cheat meal? I love to eat massive amounts of pancakes. If I'm doing pancake day, it's, it's a lot of pancakes. On top of fitness, Zach also reveals the ways he's preparing himself to get back into the dating game. For him, finding the right person is all about timing. Quote, I've really been taking time to focus on, you know, self-fulfillment and trying to find my groove. I know that probably when I meet the right person, it's going to be when I least expect it. Ask me like cooked for a date. I honestly can't even remember. <laughs> that's, that's terrible. I think I'd leave it to ordering. What last me like post mated for a date?